All right, turn back now to the weather forecast. What can we expect for the rest of the weekend? It's been so nice and people don't want you to mess it up because they, they, they blame you. Up. They I, blame you anyway. Well, it's not my fault. <laughs> we are looking at, we are looking at some changes. You won't want to blame me tomorrow. It's actually going to be nice. Once again, we will see some clouds moving back in, but by Monday and Tuesday, yeah, we are looking at some rain chances, especially Lundy Gras evening. Here's this morning's lows and it was chilly. This is going to be the coldest morning though up through Mardi Gras. 29 Macomb, 31 Bogalusa, so we did have a freezing start there and some 30s on the south shore, but will mainly be in the 40s tomorrow morning as that warming trend continues. Highs today were only in the 50s to the low 60s, but as we look ahead, increasing clouds for your Sunday, a warmer day, but dry with temperatures into the mid 60s by Lundy Gras, 72 with the chance for rain increasing, unfortunately, as we head toward parade time and then through Mardi Gras, some lingering showers, I think early in the morning, the forecast does improve as we go into the afternoon. We're quiet tonight. If you plan on heading out, there are still some clouds and we're monitoring that next system that's going to be on the way. Right now you see the rain across the desert southwest. That is the front that's going to be moving through our area on Monday. As we look at the forecast for this evening, looking good, a little bit warmer with temperatures in the 40s on both sides of the lake to start out your Sunday. And then you'll notice some some clouds will continue to increase as we head through the day as highs approach the upper 60s. And then we'll keep an overcast sky overnight into Monday. But notice still no rainfall Monday morning, so we're looking good there. But unfortunately, by the time we head toward parades in the evening is when this front will start to move in. By 2 o'clock, you see a line of showers and storms from central Mississippi into southwest Louisiana, moving into the north shore by around 4 to 5 o'clock, south shore between 7 and 8. And we could see an isolated thunderstorm. We won't have any severe weather, but the rainfall could be heavy at times and the winds pick up a little bit as this front moves through. And then we'll have some gusty winds behind this front going into Mardi Gras. Now that shows the front down toward the south, but I do think it may linger uh, near the coast, which may keep some showers around through the first half of the day, but then will improve going toward the later part of your Mardi Gras. So rain chances, nothing for tomorrow. 40% chance Monday evening and into Tuesday morning. And then we see those rain chances lowering as temperatures increase by Lundy Gras 72 down to 68 on Tuesday. And then once the front sweeps through, brings another round of some colder air with some 30s returning to the North Shore by the end of the week. But right now enjoying some pretty nice weather here in the New Orleans area, 56 degrees and do have a breeze out of the southeast around nine miles per hour. And so temperatures will drop a bit tonight. Still 52 though at Hammond and Gulfport just changed to 52 in Homa 56 again in Kenner as winds continue out of the east to the southeast, a good five to nine miles per hour. So clouds are going to increase tonight. Temperatures still kind of cold to start your Sunday in the afternoon, a mixture of sun and clouds. Great parade weather for us, though, as we'll see those rain chances increasing by Lundy Gras and the Mardi Gras and then more sunshine returns for the rest of the week. Some freezing temperatures again possible Thursday morning, but lots of sunshine taking us into next weekend.